Hospitals across the country have reported some difficulties stocking the personal protective equipment they need. Medical centers in the UP work with the Region 8 Healthcare Coalition for Hazard Preparedness, and one aspect of that is maintaining a stock of PPE. According to Ed Unger, the coalition coordinator, each hospital reports their PPE levels every day to the state so that the levels can be monitored. The Region 8 Healthcare Coalition has an emergency supply of PPE as well. We have our emergency cash supply that, that we can pull from. If uh, one of our facilities get in a bind, and for example, say they're down to the last few gowns, we're able to get them some gowns or masks or gloves, for example. Unger says that some items are difficult to order quickly, but with tracking stock levels, they are able to ensure hospitals don't run out. The Region 8 Healthcare Coalition meets every other week to check in about their PPE and preparedness situations. There's, there's a lot of stuff that's difficult to get at times. And sometimes we're waiting a, a little bit. Uh, we're always looking for uh, new vendors or new ways to uh, incorporate stuff. We're, we're very conscious and, and uh, we're making sure it's not being wasted. And we're probably, in some cases, uh, using the the uh, equipment we have uh, to their maximum capabilities um, before we're, we're uh, discarding our disposables. Anyone can check out the levels of PPE stock and other medical equipment at michigan.gov slash coronavirus by clicking the Data About Places link. Most hospitals in the UP are reporting at least 21 days worth of PPE currently. For more information about where to find information about PPE and medical equipment in the Upper Peninsula, go to upmatters.com. I'm Melissa Venix, Local 3 News.